Hey, did somebody call for a Pierce Grip install? Don't know what the hell you're doing? That makes two of us. Let's go. Hey everybody, Raw Hog here. It's gonna catch on. Today we're talking about a Pierce Grip install on a Glock 26 Gen 5. There no ammo around, the gun's been cleared. Pierce Grips, you can get them in plus one, uh, plus two, uh, depending on the model. This one's of course for the 26. Um, I didn't go with the extra rounds because when I reload mine, uh, when I re reload my 26, I just go with a Glock 19 mag. So get more rounds. It's got that little place there, little notch. Doesn't bother me any whatsoever. So I like it. But this, I'm going to take this opportunity to talk about X grip. Something else I found, uh, it's new to me. Uh, you take that grip, it slides over a Glock 19 and it eliminates that, that gap there, which I'll do a video, try to put a link down there. But as you see, it eliminates that gap. So it's just a perfect, it's great. And they make them a longer one for a 17 mag too. So you can put it in your 26 as a reload. So anyways, but we'll talk about that later. And what you're here for is the Pierce grip. So on the Pierce grip, I've done some Springfields, some things like that. Um, and they just slide right off the magazine, the, the foreplay here, you just push this button down, slide it right off, control the spring, and then slip your pierce grip on over that. So with Glocks, it's a little different. And here's why they have two notches on each side. If you can see that, I'll try to hold still. Hopefully you can see that. So that has two notches on uh, each side of this, a uh, floor plate, whatever you want to call it. So... <laughs> So you have to press this in, the, press in the sides, push this button, slide this off while keeping control of the spring because the spring and internals will shoot out. They're under pressure, obviously, so they're compressed. So they make tools for these that go in the hole and use leverage on the front side of the magazine and it pulls it off. Uh, and you just got to keep control of that. I didn't want to spend 35 bucks, something I'm only going to use a few times, probably three times with my Glock 26 mags. So. I didn't do that. I'll show you how we do it, um, how we do it, <laughs> how I do it, uh, and we'll get to it. These are very inexpensive. I mean, they work great. I mean, as you can see, the reason why you want to, the reason why is because, you know, when you go to grab it, your finger, you can't get a good grip on the gun. Obviously, you know, these type of things. So, and with a pierce grip, I mean, it just, it just feels, just feels great. So all the things we know, better control uh, for follow-up shots and all that stuff. So. Uh, we will get to that right now. All right, here we go. Got the uh, the Pierce Grip XL version out of the package. Have our Glock 26. This is a clamp that you can get at, I think you got this one actually at Walmart. You can get them at uh, Harbor Freight, anything like that. Now you have to pinch this magazine. Got to pinch it down pretty good to, it's got these latches in here, notches I guess you'd say. So, yeah, get that down, then you put this here, and you got to push in this button, and this slides off. So, everybody says it's super easy. Push that in. There we go, got it down in there. Looks so easy. <laughs> Well, it ain't. I'll pick up that skin off my finger here in just a minute. So we've had to step our game up a little bit. There we go. So I am not using that anymore. So you can release this. You just want to keep your finger over this because it will shoot off. Okay, and make sure everything is all right. I mean, I feel like I'm putting in a uh, workout at the gym. So, all right, if you could just get that over. Pull that down, grab your pierce grip. 
keep that down and then slide it back on. Just like so. Clicks into place and you have the beer script. Ready to go. So now that may look uh, easy to some, but I'll tell you, it's quite the struggle. There you have it. Pierce Grip install for Glock 26. So they make these for many manufacturers, Ruger, Springfield, Glock, I mean, on and on. It's a great addition to any firearm for obvious reasons. So I let the middle run a little bit there just so you can see when I was putting that on, just so you can see what you're getting into. It's not too bad um, and definitely worth it. Uh, in the long run but that's the kind of thing we're going to be doing here on this channel looking at guns and gear review things like that um so if that's the kind of thing you're interested in hit the like button subscribe uh down below because you don't want the soft reviews you know you like your reviews and you like them raw <laughs> yes you do so anyways muzzle loading season here open today i'm gonna try this new inline i got here can't wait give that a go i'm only kidding i'm gonna put this up and grab the flint rock Game of Fish, come on now. You guys do good work. I'm just messing around. So, anyways, for now, we're all out.